My name is uh, David Rocha, and I really wanted to share my latest art piece with you. You know, many times God speaks to us in visions and dreams according to scripture. And there's a prophet named Habakkuk. And he wrote something that's very interesting. It always stuck with me. It's Habakkuk chapter 2, starting at verse 1. He says, I will stand my watch and set myself on the rampart and watch to see what he will say to me and what I will answer when I am corrected. Then the Lord answered me and said, write the vision and make it plain on the tablets that he may run who reads it for the vision is yet for an appointed time but at the end it will speak and it will not lie though it tarries wait for it because it will surely come I will not tarry you know the prophet he stood and waited to see what God was going to show him. And whatever it is that God spoke and showed him, he grabbed the tablet to write it down. This artwork, this piece is very, very special to me. Every piece I've ever done is special to me, but this one is the first time where I painted something that I saw in my mind and in my heart. And for two to three days, this vision wouldn't let up until I grabbed a piece of paper and sketched it. Let me share it with you. I saw in my heart Jesus rising from the grave out of the tomb in glorious light. Then the tombstone would also be a clock because that's when the clock started, when he rose again. The Bible says that the devil has a short time. And then I pictured an angel, a strong, powerful angel, pointing to a world on fire. A world in complete, utter darkness and wickedness. Jesus said, I didn't come to condemn the world. I came to save it. So I imagine the Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit, flowing out of the risen Christ and heading directly to the city with an angel pointing to the very gates of hell. And the only way to there, I pictured was a bridge or the cross as a bridge because Jesus says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And I saw all this and I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to translate it with paint and brushes on canvas. But I did it. I'm only going to make 50 of these on canvas. Limited edition. And if this is something you would like, then please go to the website www.houseofrestchurch.com.